many, many centuries ago. Major League Baseball 2K7 was released to planet Earth. Weirdly enough, there was a lot of good 2K games back in the day, not even just from back in early 2000s. Not even just baseball games. There was a couple of football games, and I'll tell you one thing right now, some of the damn hockey games were way better than any EA Sports game back in those days, too. But today, there is only one thing that's going on right now. This was one of my favorite games to ever play back in the day, and I have... memories. I remember this game. A lot. I don't think I ever maybe liked a baseball game more than 2K7. Now, I will not even lie to anybody here. I will not. I, I won't. I will be honest with everybody to begin this, and I will just say what I'm going to say, and hopefully it is not the largest... Alright, I should just move on because this is... This keeps happening. Keeps going to the demo, so just advance the screen. I did not play a lot of MVP Baseball <gasps> 05 back in the day. I played a lot of baseball games back in the day, but that... You would think I'm still the same age as I was when this game first came out. I was playing a lot of All-Star Baseball 05. I was playing a lot of the 2K baseball games. There was even a game I played called Triple Play Baseball that EA Sports made. Those games were absolutely incredible, and this was probably one of my favorite baseball games of all time. If it wasn't Ken Griffey Jr.'s Slugfest from 99 or whenever the hell that was released, then it was most likely something in terms of this game. This is very old, and actually it's not Kind of. It's not the oldest game of all time, but it's not new. First thing you need to see is the rosters, because if the rosters are anything, the Jays had the old old. That logo is actually amazing. I don't know what team. Oh shit! You know it's old when the damn Devil Rays are in the game. Twenty eight. Who is last this year? Oh, the Pirates were thirtieth. So not much has changed, huh? Pirates were thirtieth. Mets were second. Oh no, 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 they were good back then. I forgot about that. Angels were fourth. What? Detroit was six, that makes sense. Rockies, uh, Jesus. Astros were like at the bottom around that time too. Astros were dog shit for a long ass time. I want a little bit of a Tampa Bay, Devil Rays, Toronto Blue Jays action going on right now. Why even mess around? Let's get right into the business. I didn't really play much of just exhibition. I was playing franchise back then for the most part, I think. The Jays didn't even have that bad of a rotation. Halliday is an absolute legend. Burnett was solid, I mean, yeah. Gustavo Chassin, Christ. Now, if you want to talk about a name you haven't heard in a while, Sean Markham, Casey Jansen, Dustin McGowan, Jeremy Accardo, for the love of shit. Rocco Baldelli, for fuck's sakes. Carl Crawford was in this game. Ben Zobras, man, he's been in the league forever. Deonor Navarro, Blue Jays legend. Dude, Vernon Wells is underrated and he needs a damn card in MLB The Show. You want to talk about Blue Jays legend, Troy Gloss, Frank Thomas, Lyle Overbay, Reed Johnson, Aaron Hill. Man, this... Yeah, I mean, this team wasn't even that bad. Like, what the fuck happened? Oh, I know what happened. The Yankees and Red Sox were like the best of all time back in like the mid, early 2000s, kind of. Wait, what team did I pick? I may have picked the Rays by accident. I might have no fucking idea how to pitch and I'm very worried about that. You think your PlayStation 4 is loud until you turn on a PS2 again. Have your room shaken. This sounds like a pressure cooker on the edge of death. This thing is going to explode momentarily, dude. The loading times, man. Dude, I'm telling you right now, these games were fucking underrated, dude. Some of the presentations and things that were going on weren't even bad. Like, yeah, you might look at this and be like, oh, well, the crowd doesn't look good, but then, you know. Coming up next. Today, it's the At the time, it was incredible. This was very good back in 2007, from what I remember. I kind of want to watch this. I just want to see what's going on here. This guy makes great contact at the plate, and you want to have someone on base ahead of his back. And Rocco, for the last couple of years, has been kind of the star of the Tampa Bay Devil Rays. But, I mean, Is that it? All right, I am about to absolutely... Or oh, wait. We'll be doing the... There's a swing and a drive. Well, so deep right field. Time is 64 degrees. Rios has room though as he puts it away just shy of the wall. He has to back the back I think I picked the raise by accident. Or did I pick nobody? From what I just saw, I maybe picked nobody. Someone get to it. How do you dive? Just like angels in the outfield. All right, come on. Don't absolutely 
Like, what difficulty is this on? I probably should have looked. 97. Oh, oh no, God. I don't know what the fuck that was, man. I don't Did I mess that up? I didn't even really look at the screen. The analog stick on this controller is very stiff, and trying to move it to one of the outside part of the plate, or one of the outside parts of the plate, dude, get under it. I don't even know if a ball is going to be caught at this point. I don't know if this is the analog stick or if it was just physically impossible to try and locate a pitch back then. The thing with this, too, is I'm pretty sure 2K7. Oh, shit. This one off the wall. How do you hit the cutoff, man? He starts him off with a strike on the inside. Why are they swinging? What happened? Why am I not swinging? Lays off this one. Hello? Dude, what the fuck is happening here? What in the fuck am I looking at here, dude? Like, is this even working right now? Why can't I swing the bat? I'm pressing X like a fucking machine, and nothing's happening. Oh. Finally. Nice rocket. I don't even give a shit. Vernon Wells is going deep. And what I mean deep, I mean going 450 to center. Where's like the fucking, can you turn like the PCI on or something? I want a moonshot. I'm not a large fan of vibrating controllers, to be honest with you. All right, here we go. All right, that didn't do anything. That just kind of showed me the fucking... It's impossible to read where the ball's gonna go, to be honest. Like, how do you... Dude, that is some smooth-ass animations, kind of. It's hard not to look at shit like that when you go back and play an old game, and it's like, all right, well, look at the new games, and then look at the old ones. Look at this dot. That'd be smoother than the current game. I'm serious. That was a smooth ass diving animation for this game being like 15 years old. Why is every pitch out of the strike zone or at like the perfect location? Throw me something down the middle. And they even nailed Frank Thomas's batting stance too. Dude, every pitch might be down and away. I'm getting spammed from the CPU right now. I don't know why the hell this analog stick is so damn stiff. It doesn't feel like this when I'm playing other games. What the hell is going on? I have to feed the CPU meatballs all game. This game is smooth. This game is really smooth. This doesn't look like it's some dog shit game. Look at these animations. This is smooth. This is like a furniture store offering trumpet lessons. This is unbelievably smooth. How is this even a thing? I just want a pitch up here. Up by the letters so I can in the zone maybe. But we get an exit velo on this. I know this might be 15 years ago, but where's the stat tracker? Someone hit a home run, man. That's it, finally. Bald hit hard. I need something at least over the fence before this is over with me. I mean, I don't really have any intentions on finishing this entire game. I just want someone to go deep and I might back out. How'd they score a run? I don't even remember. This guy. Everything down and away. Fuck off. All right, the hell with it. Let's see what else is going on for teams. I want to see the rosters. Whenever you play an old game like this, you kind of want to go back in time and see who the hell played for who. I don't know what would be an interesting team to look at because I don't remember much. American League versus National League might be incredible to look at. Who's on this team? Kenny Rogers. Holy shit. I remember that guy. That guy was like 50 when he retired. Halliday, Barry Zito, Casimir, Santana. That's why like the Mets were so good. Papelbon's ass had crazy son of a bitch. Derek Turnbow. I don't know if I remember him. And then for the fucking, oh my Jesus. Ichiro Jeter, Ortiz, A-Rod, Vlad for the love of shit, Konerko, Pudge, Vernon Wells, and Mark Loretta. Wasn't this the one in Pittsburgh? 2K Sports welcomes you indoors. The roof is closed at Chase Field in Phoenix. It was. Man, they got some... Look at this. The managers coming out exchanging the damn lineups. Back in the day, there was more attention to detail sometimes because there wasn't so many damn modes in some of these games. Barry Zito with the absolute rainbow. It didn't look like that. Dude, I'm telling you right now, this might be smoother than some of the newer games. Just look, look at this. I just want to throw this in the dirt again. Watch the catcher block it and then the smooth transition to when he gets up. Breaking ball misses and it's one and two now. That's just things you don't realize back in the day. I won't know how to dive. That was absolutely shit on.
Now, how'd I miss that? I think I figured out how to dive. It is the analog stick, and I think that went off his face. I remember the damn ball rattling around the strike zone when you just have a little bit of pressure. Is that gone? Now a swing and a ball hit in the air deep down the line and right. All right, come on. Get some outs. I want a bat here. Jesus Christ, I'm getting destroyed. Maybe throwing it. Fuck, throwing it down the middle probably isn't the best idea. I'm pressing L1 and start hitting the cutoff, man. Dude, I'm trying to aim it. It's not aiming it. No, this will absolutely get him. That's... Can I just get out of the first inning, please? I'm about to be losing 10 nothing. What a weird way to catch it. Is he stealing? Here's a swing and a drive. Deep center. There's the throw. Little bit late and he is safe. This isn't like MLB the show where it kind of just lock. Oh my fuck. Where it kind of just locks on to the ball when it's just you're in the area. You kind of have to really get under it. Otherwise, that will happen. You will run around it and it will fall and you will look like an absolute idiot. Yeah, I just need it out here because I don't know what the fuck is going on, but I'm getting my absolute hand or my what? I don't know where that sentence was going. Dude, I need Barry Zito to man the hell up here. I don't really remember how to bring another pitcher in, and I don't want to spend the time to figure it out, so I need to get some outs now. Get it out? I don't even know if I should aim it because it's going so insane in the box. Dude. All right, that was a fucking ugly ass in, and somehow they only got three hits out of it. To be honest with you, oh wait, do I have to change that damn setting again? It's not saving in between games. Gone? I'm just gonna lie here. It's kind of hard to time up a pitch a little bit. All right, I need to get a hit. I am just weak grounding out a little bit. Oh, wow, he's flying down the line. Listen, I can't be held hitless with this damn all-star. What the hell? Ichiro is sprinting back to the dugout. See, that's, that's good. I'm fine with that. Ortiz is sending this one. Hold on a second. Let's see if I can bring somebody else in who can actually get some outs. Bring Rivera in. Screw it. Bring Rivera out in the second inning. And he's pitching out of the wind -up. Actually, I think back then, if I... Oh, that's what CFB stands for. Cut fastball. I was very confused. I'm just so used to seeing cut. It's always important to start off the inning with a base hit. Dude, everything that I'm throwing, the National League is eating it alive. I, however... Oh, I didn't mean to throw that. Really? I mean, I guess when you throw at someone's face for no reason in an all-star game, maybe? You bring in Rivera to plunk somebody, and then he's done. Two. Did you see that damn out? Look at this play. That's the fucking best double play animation I've ever seen. This game is amazing. Wait, Papelbon's... Oh, well, there's someone on base. I don't even know if you could pitch out of this stretch if there was not anyone on base in this game. Come on. Somebody. A Roth. No, I don't like that. I'm waiting for something hung or very high. That's right. They have some reasonable umpires in this game. I can't buy a hit. Oh, my Jesus. Dude, A-Rod, Ortiz, fucking Vlad are grounding out. I think what you have to do is, is you have to move this where you think it's gonna go, maybe? All right, that works. I think that's what you had to do in this game. It's not like a movable object that you can move around when it's just live. You have to plan it, kind of, maybe. But put it low, because everyone's throwing shit low, and then... Yeah. Put it low. I didn't even press anything. What else did they, I don't even remember what else they had in this game besides franchise and just normal exhibition. Oh yeah, home run derby, GM career. Actually, home run derby in these games were fun as fuck. Like when you have Ryan Howard, David Ortiz, Pujols. I just want to see some tanks because clearly I'm not getting much just playing exhibition. I need something of a mode where these can just leave. I want everything shit on tonight, all right? I don't want to see any weak balls. Yeah, Ortiz knows what's going on here. That's gone. Why 
is, and he won't, I don't know what's going on if this is glitching out or something, but he won't swing every time he puts one in play. All right, well, is that it? Wait, wait, was I not controlling Ortiz? I thought I was. Is that why he wasn't swinging sometimes? Well, I think I just got trolled and I thought I was controlling both of them and I may only have been controlling Ryan Howard.